For famous street artist and photographer J.R., it was an unforgettable day. A Parisian, imagine his excitement when he received permission to make the famous glass pyramid in front of the Louvre Museum in Paris disappear. A huge image of the facade of the Louvre was used to cover the pyramid. People are constantly passing through this place, both Parsians and people from around the world. So photos are already taken of it and all the time and I wanted to play with the architecture, to play with the architecture, to play with the landmark, to interact with people because the constant link in my work is that interaction with people. JR's works are known for their precision and close-up details which make them a big hit. In the case of the 70-foot high glass monument in the French capital, he used anamorphic distortion to make the pyramid seemingly disappear. Huge photographs of the museum were carefully placed over the many glass segments to camouflage it. While the French artists played with images to bring out a new way of seeing things, artists from the Philippines took the brush to raise awareness on pollution. The artists used water pigments from different Manila rivers to create watercolor paintings. Using a totally different medium for the illustrations was a difficult task for them. At first, nahirapan kami dahil first time ko siyang... At first, it was difficult because it was the first time I experienced using dirty pigments. And second was the smell. Although the pigments have already been decontaminated, the smell of the sludge was still present. So that was a big challenge for us artists. Sludge, nandun pa rin. So ayun yung naging challenge sa aming artists. The sketches narrated the tales of those living close to the polluted water bodies. Visuals of children and families living around depicted the need to keep the rivers alive. Art is not just pretty or admirable. It does make people speak. It makes them think and most importantly, it makes them act. Art interacts. Art creates awareness.